My beloved child, I want you to know the depth of true love, the kind of love that goes beyond human understanding and expectations. This love, my love for you, is not temporary or conditional. It is eternal, unshakable, and perfect. I have loved you from the beginning of time, even before you were born, and I will continue to love you through eternity. Nothing you do or experience in this life will ever separate you from my love. True love, my child, is more than just a feeling. It is more than fleeting emotions or the temporary passions that the world often calls love. My love for you is not based on your performance, your actions, or how worthy you feel. It is based on who I am and I am love. I do not just give love, I am love. And because I am unchanging, my love for you will never change, no matter what happens in your life. In the world, love is often conditional. It is given when things are going well, and taken away when mistakes are made. But my love is unconditional. You do not have to earn it, and you cannot lose it. Even in your darkest moments, when you feel unworthy or undeserving, my love remains. I loved you at your best and I love you at your worst. I see the real you, the person behind all the masks, the fears, and the insecurities. And I love you just as you are. You are my beloved child, and I created you in my image. I knit you together with purpose, care, and intention. Every detail of who you are is precious to me. I know your thoughts, your dreams, and your struggles. I know every detail of your heart. And despite any flaws or shortcomings you see in yourself, I call you loved, chosen, and mine. The love I have for you is the kind of love that is patient, kind, and long-suffering. It does not envy, it does not boast, and it is not proud. My love is not easily angered, and it keeps no record of wrongs. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, and always perseveres. My love never fails. It is a love that seeks your best, a love that desires to see you flourish and live the life you were created for. When you feel lonely, remember that I am with you. When you feel unloved or rejected, know that I have never left your side, and I never will. I gave my life so that you could know the fullness of my love. That is the depth of my commitment to you. My sacrifice on the cross was the greatest act of love in history. I laid down my life willingly because I love you. And I would do it again because you are worth it. True love, my child, is sacrificial. It gives even when it gets nothing in return. It serves others without expecting anything back. This is the kind of love I want you to experience, not just from me, but in the relationships you have with others. Love, in its truest form, reflects my heart. It is patient when others fall short, kind when others are unkind, and forgiving even when forgiveness feels undeserved. I want you to walk in this love, not just as someone who receives it, but as someone who gives it freely. As I have loved you, so I call you to love others. The world is filled with brokenness, hurt, and disappointment. But through you, my love can reach those who need it most. I have called you to be a vessel of my love. As you open your heart to me, I will fill you with the kind of love that transforms lives, heals hearts, and brings light to the darkest places. True love is not always easy. There will be times when you are called to love those who have hurt you, those who seem unworthy of love. But remember, my love for you is not based on your worthiness. I loved you when you were far from me, when you didn't know me, and when you had nothing to offer. In the same way, I ask you to love those around you, even when it is difficult. Forgiveness is a key part of true love. Just as I have forgiven you, I ask you to forgive others. Let go of the bitterness and anger that may have built up in your heart. These things will only keep you from experiencing the fullness of my love. When you forgive, you open the door to healing, freedom, and peace. Forgiveness does not mean that the wrongs done to you were okay but it means you are choosing to release them into my hands, trusting that I will bring justice and healing in my time. True love also involves vulnerability. I see your heart, and I know that opening yourself up to love can sometimes feel risky. But I want you to know that with me, you are safe. You can trust me completely. I will never abandon you, and I will never betray your trust. I will always be there to comfort you, guide you, and strengthen you. When you feel weak, lean on me. When you feel lost, I will lead you. 
My love will never fail you. I also want you to know that loving yourself is a part of true love. Many times, my children struggle with seeing themselves as I see them. You may look at yourself and see flaws, failures, or shortcomings. But I look at you and see someone who is beautifully and wonderfully made. I see potential, strength, and a heart that is capable of great love. So, learn to see yourself through my eyes. Love yourself not out of pride, but out of an understanding that you are my creation, and I do not make mistakes. My child, true love is not just a theory or an ideal. It is a reality that I want you to live out every day. It is a love that brings freedom. Freedom from fear, from shame, from guilt, and from striving. It is a love that allows you to rest in the knowledge that you are enough because I am enough. You don't have to prove anything to me. You are already loved more than you can imagine. The more you embrace my love, the more you will be transformed by it. My love will heal your wounds, restore your broken places, and fill the empty spaces in your heart. It will give you the strength to face each day with hope and joy, knowing that you are never alone. You are loved, you are cherished, and you are mine. So, my beloved child, rest in my love today. Let it wash over you like a river, refreshing your soul and renewing your spirit. And as you walk in this love, share it with others. Let them see through you the love that I have for them. Be a beacon of hope, a light in the darkness, and a reminder of what true love really is. If you love Jesus, then please like, share, and subscribe to this video, and share it with those who need to experience the true love of God.